Risen Jesus, we come together this morning with one heart and one voice. We are many people in many places, watching on phones and tablets and laptops and TVs, here in the sanctuary, in different countries, different continents, different time zones. As many, we come to worship one. But even as we come united now, we recognize that we live in a world of disunity, of brokenness, of broken promises and broken people, of broken relationships between people, between us and the creation you placed in our care, between us and you. And we acknowledge our part in that brokenness, that we have said and done things that we ought not to, that we have left unsaid and undone things that we should have, that we too are broken, and that we too have broken our relationship with you. Have mercy on us, Lord. Forgive us, mend us, heal us, make us whole again, restore our relationships. Give us hope again, Jesus. Give us a strong faith in an extraordinary God. Help us to reach for the impossible, to not settle for the ordinary. Help us to call down your kingdom with conviction. Challenge us to lead lives that depend on an extraordinary God that we might burn with a passion for your name and that, we, that many would see the light of that fire and draw near to see what the fuss is about. Come, loving Father. Come, Lord Jesus. Come, Holy Spirit. Be near. Be here. Be extraordinary. Inhabit our praise, minister to our hearts, empower our prayers, and hear us now as we join in one heart and one voice in the words you taught your disciples, saying, Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name, your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our sin as we forgive those who sin against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. <laughs> 